Around two months ago, I set out on a challenge to try and use a controller, this specific one, in Call of Duty Mobile. And well, I kind of gave up. I even recorded this intro. I was hyping it up and going from noob to pro. And I failed. How are you meant to play with this? I played like three games, wanted to quit, never went back to it. But today, it all changes. I'm going to take this for another joyride, tell you guys exactly how it feels in the game, and if it's possible to be good with it. One thing I can guarantee is good, however, Pod Mobile, the best mobile game out right now. You can check them at the top of the description and they're sponsoring today's video. So straight away, I thought it would be a good idea to hop into right. <laughs> I'm terrible. Well, that was quite the mistake. I underestimated just how laggy this controller is. It's so hard. When I move the aim stick, it takes 500 milliseconds to move my character, which is the equivalent to playing on 500 ping MS. You do not want to try a wireless controller in this game. Oh my God. After being obliterated, annihilated, and decimated, I was pretty pissed and uncomfortable in the situation I'd put myself in. It's impossible to use this. Somehow, I managed to get a couple of kills and a nice small streak. And then, out of nowhere, my teammate carried me from this to a win. We won! <laughs> what the fuck? I decided that was enough of ranked, however. I needed to go in and practice against public match players first. I decided the CBR4 was too much of a high recoil weapon for this mechanical device and opted for an RPD little to no recoil build. I know, you're probably thinking, oh, he must have done pretty good with this. No. Man. Yep, just kept on dying. And uh, let's not even talk about my aim. After fiddling with my settings, I decided that this challenge was just awful. Oh. Have you ever thought controllers could compete on a mobile game are just silly? After playing around with the RPD and really dying a lot, I then moved on to a marksman rifle with a red dot. Oh. Aim. The MK2. I thought if I could just aim down the sight and get easy snipes, it would maybe boost my confidence a little. Oh, easy. Which, to be honest, it actually did. I felt like I was leveling up in skill. Kill after kill after kill. My fingers were tingling and my mechanics were improving until I went on a massive streak. Keep in mind, this is public match. But dude, I'm using a controller. Of course, once you see that second advanced UAV, you know what's about to go down. I almost died to a bot trying to knife him. Kicking ass. Oh, for the nick! Let's go, I knifed him, man. My first ever wanted controller. Well, it wasn't ranked, but still. I played some more public matches, but I knew that now was the right time to go back on to ranked and see just how bad a controller is. I completely underestimated just how long it would take to find games in ranked with a controller because I only go up against other controller players. In fact, day after day after day, I just kept dying. As all of these controller players were cracked. There's no way that guy is using a controller. I don't know how they done it. Because when I use this thing, it sucks. It's laggy. Maybe I have the wrong controller. And I should try it out with a better one next time. Obviously, I was using the RPD because it was meant to be spray and pray weapon. But like public matches, it turned out that the MK2 was the better choice. The only way I could possibly do this is if I camped and hard scoped everything. Kill after kill. The start of this game was going good. This isn't really a good map for the MK2, but I was making it work. As time dragged on, I continued to play super passive and slow. Boring, I know, but it's literally the only thing I could do, I swear. My movement was terrible. Do I need to even show a clip of me trying to aim again? Like, Come on. Locked up in that wooden house, I let them come to me. One bobby after another bobby after another. My streak was ludicrous. And with my hands firmly gripping the joysticks of my controller, I was able to wrap things up. Wait for him, wait for him. There he is! Oh my God. <laughs> Would I recommend this? No. Should you subscribe? Yes.